an unexpected visitor from across the Atlantic Ocean. The snowy egret's usual home is the Americas, but astoundingly, it's found its way to the southern tip of Africa. It's the second time it's ever been seen in southern Africa. Uh, it's a bird that uh, occurs in North and South America and uh, it's obviously been caught up in a storm or something and been displaced eastwards across the Atlantic Ocean and now carried on migrating further south and landed up here. Similar to the local wading birds, snowy egrets have yellow patches on their eyes and legs. For the birders who've come here from around the country, this is what they call a lifer. A first ever sighting of a species that can be ticked off their lifelong list. Very rare sighting. It's as we call it in birding terms, a mega, mega, mega rarity, a special. And that's why we all condescend down on Cape Town from all over the show. It's my 800th bird and it's a massive milestone in my birding career. I never thought that I would get this because this can easily turn out into a blocker, eh? which means that nobody, if you're not here now, you might never see it again in Southern Africa. But experts say the visit will likely not be that long. It'll probably feed up, re-energize a little bit, and then hopefully move off and try and find its way back to where it should be. For now, though, the snowy egret is enjoying celebrity status among a select group of people. And who knows, perhaps you'll like it so much, you'll come back for another visit. Travis Andrews, CCTV, Cape Town.